Hello everyone and welcome back. This is Captain MKG here. Thank you so much for joining me once again for another episode of Subsistence. As you can tell, we are just beginning the day. We're all good and set here. I did make sure to rekindle the fire. We have some more meat. So we are all set to get going. Thank you so much again, like I said, for joining me here. We are going to be starting over from this new base here because we do have access to water and we have access to a big sensor here so we can always get three six logs and always be productive. I'm also listening to Devil Doll episode in the background. Alright, I saw the bear over there. I know, I know. If either of them come charging at me. Gotcha. Run like hell. Now, since I know the hunters are over there, or a hunter is over there, I should say, it would probably be a good idea to potentially expand the base over there and create kind of a little waterway, as it were. Which could be interesting. I know, but I need your protein. And while we're here, let's go ahead and just drop... So we'll, get, we'll just drop the logs in there. I will keep you, drink you. Alright, until we get everything over here, I think we're going to go ahead and just ignore a few things. One of them being, well, let's face it, I have to ignore mining for a while until I can get most of the stuff over here. So, maybe this will be a moving day episode, who knows. As soon as we get this chicken cooked up and our water purified, We'll get right back on the road, and we'll probably start from the rock, from the rocks over there, and just go from there. But let's go on. Let's get our chicken back cooked. We have plenty of arrows for now. Excellent, and it's okay if this fire goes out. I'm not too concerned with this one. All right, into the depths. We have to suffer a little bit. We're going to have to be wet for a little while, but that's okay. We're going to do what we have to do in order to survive. Especially surviving all of the damn random hunter attacks. First things first, we have to get the bulk of everything loaded over here and relocated. Now, one thing I'm going to be wondering about is if... Uh, once we disable... Or once we... Uh, dismantle the original base command unit if we can go ahead and get um, you know our new base our new BCU here uh, spooling up energy and mass on its own I'm not sure if that's even possible but we're bound to find out as you venture onward into the morning oh sure now all of the fibers and everything are here. Uh, again, we're only going to just focus on the big sixers. We're not going to worry too much about mining today. We're just going to have to make sure to watch out for our good friends, the hunters. So let's see here. Two. All right, cool. All right, so we have a full clip. So we have at least that safety measure for now, in case we do run into a wolf, like so. We'll probably get that wolf at some point, just because he is a level 3, which means more meat, more fat, and a better chance of getting some useful cloth from him. I could have sworn I saw another one over here. Could be I was probably mistaken. That's fine. But as a constellation prize, I did see the crate. Not too bad. Backup crate. And I know I saw a construction for a building crate over here. Is it. Or did it disappear on me? Shit. Oh, there it is. Like, I knew I didn't miss it. Okay, let's see here. So right now, so 
not seeing anything new. Let's go ahead and head back closer towards the base area, except for that's a bear. And what we're going to do is actually we're going to go ahead and I think another item of area to explore here would be to go ahead and, damn. Yeah, yeah, I hear you. I'm getting the hell away from you. Another item to explore over here would be to go ahead and actually construct as much of the items and useful materials that we'll need at the new base over at the old base first, migrate everything, and then just start making use of what half supplies we get. So hopefully there's no wolf, otherwise this will be a quick one of death. Ooh, very cool. Alright. So, oh, come on. Okay, so between this base, we have a lock rate. So that means I'm going to go ahead and actually, when we get settled, actually not when we get settled, when we get a lot of the stuff done, I'm going to go ahead and actually, sure, now you bring up the matches, you son of a bitch gate. So when we get back to the base, we'll go ahead and build a lock pick, just so it's done, because, well, that is going to have a lot of useful materials in there. Oh, you game, you're just you're just rubbing it in now. Now there's everything here. God. Well, at the very least, the old base is not too far away from the new base. So I could probably easily grab that lock crate. Shit. And I probably just burned that arrow, didn't I? I lost a fucking arrow. God damn it. Oh, you. Oh, sure. Rub it in, you son of a bitch chicken. Oh, is that it? No, that was just a figment of my imagination, as usual. So, with that disappointing result, we'll go ahead and grab. Hopefully, they haven't destroyed too much yet. Thought I saw something to the right there. Alright, so they haven't really broken into anything too crucial yet. But our fire is still going. That's awesome. Oh, damn it. Oh, well. That's okay. Oh, I meant to kill. Sorry. You up right now? Cool. So now that we're back at the base, we have plenty of power. Uh, let's see here. So I need to create a lockpick, that's the first thing. So I need power... 18, 2, and 4. 4, 1, 2... And... Doo -doo 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 -doo. That's right, I need power. So let's crank up these. Because we're going to go ahead and start crafting as much as we can. You back on. Oh, perfect. 15 iron. So we'll have a lock pick here in just. Oh, I need 18 pieces, son of a bitch. Aha, uh -huh, there we go. Perfect. 18. Let's make another fuel brick while we're waiting. Fiber away. Those away. Those away. Okay. We're getting there. The shoddy will have soon. Some stuff to kill. I'm sure, now I have a fuel brick. Alright, well. Alright, so while we're waiting for that, what we need to make here is the lockpick is the first thing. Next, we need to make the wood burning stove. That's going to require more mass. Two, seven, three. Perfect. Uh, da -da 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 -da. two. Seven, three, okay. So we'll be able to get the wood burning stove going here shortly. And we have lots of everything here. So we're going to run everything as fast as we can. Go ahead and start considering what to put away, what to save. So let's see here, what else can I do while we wait? Eventually, we're going to have to boogie out of here. So, wood burning stove is going to be one thing. 
we have everything there, so I want to go ahead and just wait for a second, so I'll be right back. Alright, so now we got that done. I'm gonna go ahead and put just about the safe side. Put the rest of the cordage in there. Start depositing some stuff. Oh, I want to bring those with me. Uh, do, 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 do. How are you doing? You're fine. Actually, I need to take one. See here. No wood to speak of. It's okay. Let's go ahead and see what they're up to, if anything, because while I've been sitting here waiting for stuff to turn around, I've been hearing them moving around. So I know they're getting ready for their their own fun as well. We're gonna go ahead and try and dismantle what we can here without going too crazy. And see if I have an extra spawn in the bed here. If not, the bed is going. Oh, I do have one spawn. Okay. So I have one spawn available there, so I'll keep that there for now. I will, however, probably move it downward, just so it's not... That son of a bitch is out here, too. So as soon as they're done fishing... There we go. Let's see here. What the shit? He's already got a tactical vest on? That is some crap. Oh yeah. You guys are way too close for comfort. This is just fascinating behavior for me to watch. I wonder... No, I really don't want to test the waters today. Alright, so... See what else can we take? Down? Are we going to use the refinery anymore? No. So let's go ahead and dismantle this. Okay. We are going to need more power. Stove. So we are going to need to be rebuilding a bunch of stuff. But first things first, I want to be able to rebuild the generator. Actually, I just want to be able to build a generator, so I need more mass for that. Turn the mass back on. You guys walk away finally. Oh, son of a bitch. That moose is definitely going to be a problem, isn't it? Aren't you? Well, other note for myself is the fact that I just need to not expand as much. But we'll get there. Alright, so for the small power generator, we need just more more mass, essentially. And then once we have that established, I need to create something that will generate mass as well. So I'll have to be the mass fabricator. Provided, of course, if this one, you know. But we will see here. Start taking some of the roof out. Okay. We're getting closer. I just want to make sure those guys are not anywhere near me when I decide to make the jump. More to the point. Oh, it's the moose! That's what's moving around. Well, I'll be damned, Moose. You're just you're just putzing around, aren't you? Making it impossible for me to make an escape. Damn, 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 damn. Man, that Moose is gonna take forever, aren't you? Oh, don't come back. If I had enough ammunition, I'd try and take some bitch out. But since I don't, I'm not really going to risk it. Speaking of things to risk on, uh, hmm. No, I don't want to eat a raw onion right now. 
How's this doing? Go ahead and drop one in. Let's see, how are we doing on this? Oh, perfect. We're just about ready. And crank it. Alright, so now we have... Alright, so now we're going to generate our power. We have our stove. We have our generator. The next thing we're going to need to make over here is the... Um, sorry, is the mass fabricator. So I need... Uh, not enough material, apparently. So let's drop off what materials we can for now. We have enough to get us going. This has been fully stocked. See where everybody's at. These guys are over there. Excellent, the moose has gone away. We could try and nail this chicken. Ooh! Ooh, that was a good shot! Oh man, that was a damn, damn fine shot. Woohoo! Damn, I'm sorry, chicken, but damn, damn, am I good? All right, Nima, let's not get ahead of myself. I gotta find that lock crate, which I'm hoping isn't too difficult to find. After all, to make it safely back to the new base. Without so much as a headache. Oh, there it is. Alright, hopefully we're good and clear. Hopefully we're good and clear. No hunter, please. And we'll look at the loot later. Oh my balls. Amaze balls, dudes. Dude. So many shotgun shells. I don't care about you right now, chicken. I, right now, I only care about one thing, and that is getting back to my main base. Or, well, I guess the new base. Oh, not going that way. Oh, son of a bitch, that's why. Oh, no. Hopefully I can just avoid him and just not encounter him at all. Go behind enemy lines. Pray. Nope, I missed. Fuck me, fuck me, fuck me, fuck me. Yep, you missed that one, buddy. I'm running the hell away from you. Hopefully he doesn't pursue. But at least I got the lock crate. It's a crate over there. Alright, well, that's good to know that we have another neighbor to avoid. Which makes moving day all the more important now. Is he still pursuing? Getting better. Getting better. Now, it might be excessive taking all these little critters out, but they are necessary for survival because of their feathers and claw potential. Alright. Nobody is around this nick of the woods. Thankfully. So, and if anybody does decide to build up on the beachfront property, well, we'll be the first to know. Alright. So far, so good. Whee! Searching for kelp. Up, up, and away. Yeah, this is the one one thing I have noted here is that Cold Games really does need Oh my god, seriously, you fucking kidding me with the goddamn moose again? Jesus Christ, they're everywhere. Alright. Let's get some stuff in here and put down. Alright, so first things first, let's put our generator in. Perfect. And then our wood burning stove in right next to it. You know, that should probably cause an explosion, but it doesn't. Yeah, buddy. Alright. 
Yeah, we are doing doing well right now. Awesome. Fantastic. Well, this should be good and interesting. Oh, and I got more of the advanced gun parts. This is going to be sweet. And sinew. Yes, to sinew. Alright, boots, boots. Four and five. Just enough for some boots. Do I need to repair this one? I can't repair it anyways. It's like, damn, Moose, get the hell away from me. Okay. So we got that done. Damn. That's level 2 Moose. Unfortunately, I don't really have any guns to really utilize what I have here. So now let's take out some raw materials and see what we can accomplish. Take those, and a couple more of those. Alright, so again, this is, that's not generating anything. Uh, we need to go ahead, where is he? Damn. I need to essentially, as painstaking as it sounds, build a bridge. Oh, wow, okay. That is different. I was not expecting the moose to do that. Wow. Okay. So moose can swim. Okay. Great. That's that's just great. Oh! Oh man, that'd be awesome, dude. So cold games, if you're watching, or I may just write this in a forum somewhere. What you really need to do is put in some squirrels. So that way we can start having the joke of moose and squirrel. I know. Only so many people will get it, but It'd be damn funny. Alright. Both you two. And we'll go ahead and build another wood foundation. Oh, Seriously? I'm out of fiber, of all things to run out of? That's okay. And really? Again with the sun going down this fast? Son of a bitch. Well, that's that's the name of the game, I suppose. Feels good. Go ahead and restock up on the water. Put that over here, ready for us when we come back. No fuel for that. Yeah, not even a smidge of fuel for it. So, so chopping logs it is for a little while until someone comes after me. Now, hopefully. If I'm half the smart editor that I think I am, I will have slimmed this down so that way, once again, we're not wasting daylight. And you guys aren't just wasting watching me just, you know, chop logs all day because you can do that yourselves. Hell, you could probably do that in real life and actually make something productive for a change. But since we're not, we've got this to work with. Just go ahead and do a couple of these real fast. Hopefully not get ourselves not get ourselves mauled. Damn, I thought there was a crate over here. But ooh, well, I'll be damned. A crate. Thank you. Now we also have to remember that the rogue hunter is just over the bend as well, so we can't really go too far. But we can go a little bit far. And since we do have some spare ammunition, I don't want to get cocky. Perhaps we can take out this level 3 wolf. If we're lucky. Damn it. Come on. Alright. Be one, be steady. That'll work. That will work. That'll do, Wolfie. That'll do. Oh yeah, precious fuel. First things first. Gotta rinse up. Always got to wash up because you don't want to get an infection. Now we have some extra protein to work with. Fortunately, not too much in the way of log chopping right now, but that's okay. Damn it. We did at the very least take out that wolf, so we have something to work with tonight. 
We're going to stay out here as long as we can. Preferably until it gets too cold. And then we'll head back to base. Take care of all that fun stuff. Well, maybe I won't maybe I won't forward, fast forward this part. Who knows? I'll figure it out. Now I do know that from my test runs, oh this will be the last one because now it's getting too dark. From my test runs, once the weapon or so or so, or bow and arrow more specifically, once it runs out of usability, it won't disappear. Uh, but you do have to repair it. Now, unfortunately, with that in mind, since you do have to repair the item, you can't repair the pickaxe for some reason. So it's useful to carry a couple pickaxes around with you, just to be on the safe side, so that way nothing goes awry. Now, unfortunately, I don't have many cordage left, or at all, really, except for up to two. So I'll craft that, take you. And precious fuel. Precious, precious fuel. Oh, I guess I can't. Now what the hell was I going to make, though? That's where I was going to make a wood foundation. One, two, three. Ooh, excuse me. Alright. Craft that up. I really would like to go ahead and get... Craft that as well. I would really like to go ahead and get um, some more fruit and veg, because I am suffering. Oh, that's right, I need some bullets. Just to be safe. So I didn't necessarily need to fire five rounds, but four rounds is plenty sufficient to take that son of a bitch down. Alright, now we'll go ahead and place it one more out. And then we'll probably do one more and then I can start building the bridge out that way. Now in terms of building the bridge, I think what I may end up doing is trying to create or trying to use the ceiling walls. Or sorry, the ceilings. And just trying to go from there. So alright. Can I do anything else with what I have? Let's put everything but ten arrows away. Well, now I have enough scrap over here. Arrows. Yep. Oh, there we go. Damn it. Well, there goes that. So, okay. Alright, so once again, chicken time. Well, we're good on protein, but we're sucking on the fruit and veg. So, once again, guys, we're going to go ahead. I'm going to let this thing speed up and. I will, yeah, I think at the end of this I'll probably see you guys in the next one, whenever it gets ready. So let's make sure I don't have any fuel bricks, so, hmm, that could be a problem. Can't though? No, not really. I could probably harvest some logs before I head out to the next moving day and grab that. It's already November, guys. Jesus, I have not been paying attention. Well, at least the moose are done, you know, hoarding around and running around and causing, you know, a bunch of crap. So, um, that'll be good. Well, at least running around and going back for a moving day part two. Now, one thing I wish we could do with the meat when it, when it gets bad is I wish we could throw it in here for fuel. But, you know, we can't because I think it should be able to burn. Or at the very least, be able to put it into the rendering fat and just try to get the fat out of it or something, but you know, short out the heating pads, it's mostly just used for um, you know, at this point, it's mostly just, yeah, it's just used for those heating pads or, you know, just regular crap, so alright guys, I am not going to stick around here for much longer, so I will yeah, since the queue's pretty much done, I will see you guys next time